Hey there friends, on today's video we are going to be unboxing and installing, giving a quick review of this Pure Shine Double. It's a two pack LED floodlight for your garage or any other place where you need a large amount of LED light to illuminate a dark area. Let's open this box and check out what's inside. So the folks at Pure Shine actually sent this over to us as a sample. They wanted us to install it, give it a quick review. And this isn't a paid review, so we're gonna do our best to really show you all the features, as well as let you know if there's any faults that we potentially see. So it actually comes in multiple color options, you can see. Uh, we actually got the black, just the simple black. And then you also have a power indicator of 60 watts. Now this is an LED. Uh, equivalent to what you're gonna see in your traditional like light bulbs. Uh, again, because this LED, it just uses a whole lot less power and it throws an amazing amount of light in the exact same space. Okay, inside the box, we have our two floodlights. Again, this is great because it comes with two. And we also have our quick instructions. Again, super easy. It's literally unscrewing your old light bulb and screwing the new one in. We just need to make sure we remove these little plastic uh, protector caps. Here's our basic parameters for what we can use the garage lights with. And then obviously on the safety instructions, make note of this, this is not for outdoor use. They are not designed to be outside. Okay, now checking out the floodlight itself. You can see that it comes with all of the LEDs in the upright position, but what's really neat about these is they're highly adjustable. So you can actually point these LED panels in the direction that you want the light thrown. Or you can have a couple of them in an upward direction if you have a wall nearby, and then maybe this one is thrown out a little bit more towards an area that needs to be illuminated in that downward position. Again, highly adjustable. You can see the panels are this nice high quality kind of plastic covering with the LEDs underneath. The LEDs actually shine onto this coating, which again, throws the light in a more natural kind of manner. You can see we have our power indicator for what kind of wattage that this is going to be compatible with. The body is made of a semi-durable plastic. This isn't anything that I would call super highly durable. Again, if it's outside and you get some hail damage or even water would really, really kind of mess this up. So again, I am gonna confirm that uh, this is gonna be an indoor product for sure. All right, now that we have a basic overview of the product, let's go ahead and install them and get an idea of what kind of light they are able to throw. Okay, we're out in the garage. And I've got on this side a traditional 65 watt bulb. And what I've done is I've installed another floodlight over at the other side of the garage. And friends, there is a massive, massive difference. It's really hard to tell on video, but over here in this corner, there's just all sorts of dark shadows. Again, because this bulb, traditional bulb, just has the ability to throw light in kind of a cone shape. Whereas the floodlight, you can really send directional light in any, area that you want. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna swap this one out so you can see the process. All right, now the great thing about these floodlights is literally it's just changing a light bulb. I'm gonna unscrew this old traditional one and then we're gonna just screw in the floodlight just like that in reverse. Just go until it's snug. Again, don't over torque this because it is plastic. You don't want to break off one of these arms. Okay, with it in place, again, make sure the power is off when you're changing this. Uh, I'm gonna maneuver these arms in a direction that I want. Again, I have a surfboard that's sitting right here, so I don't necessarily need light flooding down through there. I can potentially put this one in the down direction. We'll place this one a little more up so that it's shining out, and this guy a little bit more over to this Backside so it can reflect off of that back wall. You can do whatever you want, get in, these in any kind of configuration that best works for your garage. Okay, once we have this in place, let's go ahead and flip it on and see what kind of light we get. All right, again, this is gonna be a little bit hard to see on video, but already I'm getting a massive amount of light that's being thrown down over here into our adventure corner in the garage. I am really, really liking these floodlights. 
Again, time will tell how durable they are, but again, it's a light and LEDs last for a long time. So I think this is, again, gonna save us money. We're gonna get a lot more light in the garage, which is ultimately what we wanted to do. I think it's a great product. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up now. Stay tuned, we'll probably make a six month review video just to make sure everything's still working okay. Friends, if you like this light, I'll actually put a link in the description box below where you can pick it up for yourselves. Again, this is a product that was sent to us for review for free. Hope this has helped. If it has, would you guys hit that thumbs up button and stay tuned because we're gonna make some more review videos coming up really, really soon. Thanks so much for watching.